I'm doing some formulas in Access 2013. They work pretty much the same as they do in the earlier versions of 2010 or 7, even before. What it is, we, we've done a query on some video games. We did put in a criteria for a tour. The first thing we want to do is we want to put on a fee on the mature ones okay we want to add twenty five dollars and to the game value I'm going to show different ways of doing this uh, very often they, they encourage the use of the expression builder which is what I clicked on it shows the field names the game value has what it costs and then I say plus 25 it's 25 dollars I say okay it gives us the XBR one double click on it will just say fee we'll run it and it's showing how it went up 25 dollars I tend to go back and forth looking at things as I go along to make sure I did it right you can check with the calculator the next thing we want want to do is to calculate the sales tax let's say the state that we're in we're charging seven and a half percent it's based on the fee I'm gonna save this you gotta keep saving if you wanna see things as you go along and so if I click on the builder it will show fee and then we're going to multiply it by 0 0.075 we don't want to type in seven and one half percent if I go at the beginning I'm going to type in total followed by a colon so it's going to show it there go over there total wait a minute we should have called this tax go back here double click call it tax we'll format later next thing we want to do is the shipping the shipping is based on the fee and what we can do in here we can literally type it shipping followed by the colon fee times let's say it's 12 percent point one two run it so we got the shipping the tax the fee now we want to know what the total cost is you could use the zoom tool shift F2 so what I'm gonna do here I'm just gonna type in total cost no spaces colon we're just gonna type in the fields that we did fee plus tax plus I spelled shipping wrong doing this deliberately if I go to run this it's gonna ask a parameter we don't want this so what we do we could do shift F2 brings us up into there and I could just go into here type in another P make sure it's in the right place okay run it it shows the shipping or the total cost we're gonna put currency here last thing I want to do I want to do some formatting I want to read total cost right click properties format you can make it currency automatically too you could put in spaces total cost 
We run this. Looks better. We have to fix the shipping. We click in here. Format as currency. Run it. So it's giving us the numbers, the totals. Always check with a calculator that, that you did it right. So we could save and exit from the query.